Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Hyper Mind Vanilla Surfer. That's right, we're back here. We're over at the Witch Farm. As you can see behind me, we've got a little bit of a project today, and I'm not even going to go into our standard intro. No, we're going to get right into it. So, let me just say, it has been a while for us to be on the Vanilla Surfer. We've done a little bit here and there. The last time we were together, we had the Boat Pig Memorial, but... It's really been kind of dry, and I, some of you might be wondering, where in the world is Hypermind Vanilla content? Well, it's coming back, okay? It's coming back. The reason why that it's been kind of dry is because I've been focusing on a certain project that you can see all around here. You see that? Yep. It... Um, it's been taking up my time. I've wanted to focus on this, and, and well... That just doesn't leave much time for planning anything else. So we have been working on this perimeter dig, and that is ongoing project. But we're going to do something more about that today, okay? Now, in the meantime, I've also been kind of, I don't know, unmotivated. You know, I took that break off at the end of 2016, and it's been kind of slow to get started back in 2017. And... um I'm just hearing some really weird, really weird audio stuff going on. Okay, anyway, uh, that notwithstanding. Um, so I've been kind of unmotivated, if you will. And, and you know, when, when you're in Minecraft and you get unmotivated, I mean, the main thing is I've been trying to hold off on some content production or just to bring it to you, and I haven't been really playing the game, and so you know what I just decided to do? I decided to play the game. So let's turn back around here, and we're going to take a look at some of what I have done. You can see some of it poking around right there. Let's go over there and see what we have to see. Look at that. Yep, I went to the end. That's been the main update for... What is this? 1.11? 1.10, I think? When was all that new that stuff for the end? I can't remember which version it was, but suffice it to say, it's, um, yeah. Anyway, I finally taken, uh, taken the plunge and I, I went into the end. I went to some of those new end islands. I took this elytra that Kondrick provided and I went around to some end cities and you can see gotten some shulker shells we also got yeah i got some coarse flour so that's cool but we got a decent amount of loot from the in cities as well so a couple of good picks uh let's see oh that not so much but a couple of good swords as well and and yeah some decent armor a lighter and all that and um, full confession mode, you, you might see these buttons up top and you're wondering, what in the world is that? That is inventory tweaks. I am running a modded client. We've got inventory tweaks installed. We've also got journey map installed and um, something else we're going to be playing with today. Let's see if we can bring this up. Oh, I know what it is. It's this thing that's making the noise. Oh, we got three seeds off of that one. That's cool. Awesome. Anyway, um, we're also running another mod, and let's see if we can get to it here. Let's hit escape. Mod options. Let's look in here, see if we can see it. Replay mod. Yep, we're running replay mod. Very excited about that because we're going to be playing with that today. Yep. The reason why, well, um, we've got, and I'm going to bring up journey map. This is the reason why I wanted to use journey map with you today in particular is that we've just got this swath of land left. So I'm going to be moving this or this beacon or this beacon over to this spot right here. And then we're going to clear out this entire thing. And I'm going to use replay mod to record the whole thing, put it in a nice little time lapse for you here soon. But before we get into that, I also need to show you a little bit more work. Um, and let's address something else here. The missing texture texture is right here. This is the crafting bench. And this is showing up because the B00 texture pack does not work with some combination of either Forge 
or Optifine. I'm not sure which one. I think it could be the combination of both, but they are working together to say, hey, I don't understand your texture. I can't do much about it. I've edited the texture pack before to get rid of that, but um, you have to keep editing it every time you get a new download. So I'm just going to leave it like that. And if you ever see the missing texture texture pack or missing texture texture in my videos, it's because Forge and Optifine and the BW texture pack just aren't working together. Anyway, let's go into these two chests, this one right here and this one right here, and take a look. I spent some more time, okay? This, this is completely off camera. I took care of a lot. Oh, we've got a restart in five minutes. We got a lot of crafting and enchanting done. Um, and I bought a bunch of books off of villagers over at Port Hypermine. And we've got a bunch of Efficiency 5 Silk Touch picks. And a bunch of Efficiency 5 Fortune 3 picks. And decent amount of Efficiency 5 Silk Touch shovels. That's what we're going to do. I wanted to get a decent amount so we don't have to keep going back and forth to the end. I can pretty much do um, something on the order of 12 Silk Touch picks and... 18 fortune three picks per beacon section so this right here is one beacon section i've been able to to you know figure out the math on that but we need a little bit more to cover that whole area i might still have to go back to the yeah the gold farm and repair all that stuff but yeah that's what we're going to be doing i am going to load up the replay mod we're going to re start recording all of that and uh, we'll put that little little time lapse here uh, just, um, just around the break here. All right. See you on the other side.
are back, ladies and gentlemen. We are back. Take a look at this. Oh, this is glorious. It is done. It is done. I'm coming back over here because, well, I was looking on our overviewer map and I found we had a few bits left over here. It's not a problem. We just come back through and fix that right up. I did not mean to drop in and do this right now, but I saw those two hanging out. And let's take this off for now because that gets kind of annoying. And we're going to go back over to the overview map real quick. I'm going to bring that up just so I can see it. Is it going to let me know Chrome? Chrome is not going to respond. Nope. Okay. Chrome doesn't want to respond to me. That's fine. That's fine. Not a problem. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed that time lapse. I'm not entirely sure how it's going to go. Um, because I haven't taken a look at the footage yet. It's something like 25, 26 uh, pieces of replay footage to go through. And that means I've got my work cut out for me. And um, I don't even know if they are, are good to go or not even. So, um, so yeah, I could be in for a big surprise once I actually log in to the replay mod editor and renderer just to see but who knows uh, in the meantime since we were last together with the time lapse we have changed to springs up where is it it's in the top top right corner right here 17w06a and i'm currently on with wreckabilly i've not seen in quite some time but he's been building away he just hadn't been recording anything lately but uh, he's got a nice little base going yeah so uh, we've updated to the latest snapshot that is the 1.12 snapshots and so we've got concrete powder and concrete and terracotta blocks which is pretty exciting some more decorative blocks are are possible now Let's just take this out. See, you occasionally miss stuff like this. It's really hard to get these details. In fact, sometimes I questioned why I even decided to clear out even in the bedrock, but it is what it is. That's the decision we made on the first couple of chunks, and so kind of stuck with it. I kept on going, going long term. Anyway, this is not what I wanted to be doing right now. Let's get out of here. Let's see if we can go over to... Uh, to, to this part here. We're not going to get much else done in this episode, and I hear some of you just clicking off at, at this moment uh, to to go on and watch other stuff. That's fine. I just wanted to, um, to bring you in real quick, kind of go over some things. We're not going to do tons because we've already done a lot. That took quite some time to clear out the rest of this perimeter, but that's... Um, that, that was the main part of the project. So from here on out, since we've got this cleared out perimeter, we're going to be working on a number of projects here. Namely, um, we need to redo the, the farm here. We need to change that out and go with a more efficient one. And we also need to, well, we're going to use this perimeter for a lot more than just the witch farm. When we're going to tear out that squid farm and we're going to have the witches dropping in that whole area now. So we have to move the squid farm. We're also going to have a reed farm and a slime farm and a passive mob farm. That's right. We're working on another large project over in spawn, clearing out the grass in that area. Uh, what we're going to do up here is take down this high Y tower because we don't need it anymore. No, we are done with this. We've got the full perimeter, which means there are no spawnable spaces or anything other than witches inside the uh, witch farm. So that means no other hostile mobs anywhere. We don't have to get out of the way of caves or anything like that. We are good to go. Anyway, what can you expect? Well, you can expect that we are going to be continuing the streaming, but we're probably going to have another a bigger focus on YouTube videos from now on because uh, really, it was just really hard for me to 
uh, get motivated about video production while that perimeter dig was ongoing. So that's why videos have been kind of thin. Okay, we've got, let's see if we can fill this in. I'm going to be careful not to do, okay, how about this one? There we go. Okay. Yeah. So even without a haste two beacon, we still get the ghost blocks. Okay, whatever. See? Yep. It could just be my internet connection too. How about that? Good. So we'll try and Yeah. How about that? We'll just face it off to the side. That way we can only hit one at a time. So yeah, we're going to be bringing videos back and we'll probably be incorporating live streams into that to take care of some of the grindy work in between, but you can expect to see more YouTube videos from now on. And we're going to be focusing here on vanilla. Vanilla is the mainstay. It's what the channel started on. And it's really just, I don't know. I just, I just prefer it um, right now. I'm more motivated. we got tons of projects to do. So, uh, yeah, that's where we're going to focus anyway hopefully you enjoyed yes we didn't well we didn't get a lot of different things done but you know what we got kind of the most important thing done and that is this perimeter dig and uh something else i wanted to show you real quick before we get kicked off for the server restart it is time to take a look at the statistics are you ready blocks times mind stone there we go. 3.6 million stone mined. And that is, well, it's from a mix, not just this perimeter dig, but some of the other diggy diggy projects. But there we go. That's, that's not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. Man. Times mined, how about picked up? I did not pick up all that much stone, but times used. Still dirt. Okay, well, oh, there we go. How about over here? Times used. <laughs> there you go. Diamond pickaxe, 3.8 million times. Awesome. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. Hopefully you enjoyed, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for sticking around for this particular project. I know it took a long time, but hey, we got it done. That's exciting. Exciting times ahead. We've got this perimeter done. So... More to come. Anyway, join me next time. I'm not sure what we're going to do. We've still got we got some work going on at spawn. I'll probably show some of that off in the next video, but uh, I'm getting ready to start a live stream where we're going to do some more work on that. But anyway, that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't done so already, think about subscribing so you're up to date with everything going on in the channel. But that's going to be it for now. Again, thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Bye bye.